Yeah. Old school. That's yeah. There's another dial down here. Oh, what's this? There we go. Gosh, it's so much stuff up here. I'm scared to grab something. Don't, oh! Don't be scared. Oh, yeah. I just see something up there. Could be worth some money. Woodstock. Oh, no. Oh, yes. How are we doing today? Robert Zaba Auctioneer Extraordinaire Second Sense Auctions and I'm here at this unit. I paid over $500. The gentleman had two storage units. I bought them both but the manager said get in. the guy ended up paying for the second one so he only had enough money to pay for one. I asked the manager is there anything this guy wants back? He said no. So I'm putting stuff aside if I think maybe there's photos or something he might want back and this unit has been I don't know how to explain it's been different than most units but we found everything antiques collectibles all kind of cool things if you haven't seen the last video jeff what do they need to do uh click and subscribe and watch it yeah click subscribe watch it guys it's free easiest thing to do who knows what we're gonna find still look at how much stuff left we're gonna try to get it all through in one video but i mean old sewing machines watch parts watch making things watch repair stuff um, I, just, I guess we'll start right up here. We got boxes, boxes, boxes. This box doesn't look too great. You want to uh, use that? Ew. But the way this goes, you got we got to look at what we got to dig deeper because just in case there's something down here. It's kind of weird. Ash there's drink. two squares. Are you talking about me and you or these? No, yep, yeah, those. <laughs> I thought you were talking about you and me. These are speed squares, framing squares. I think speed squares, right? Uh, Regulators, Den of Thieves. They didn't make me any faster. 2017? Huh. Cards. What is this? It's a little light up house. It's dirty. It is dirty. Alright. We got a whole. Thing. What the heck is this? First, I see the case. A duct tape case. Oh, oh, oh. I don't know. I like what I see. Looks like an old, old, old flag. Looks like a very old flag. Oh, yeah, and oh, that's a damn. That's a Nazi flag. No way. I think so. That looks like oh, the. Oh my gosh. Is that a swastika? Is that what that's called? That is. This is a um, banner. Oops. It, it looks to be. Looks beat. Well, yeah, it's old. And uh, authentic. It appears to me to be authentic. The material seems right. Um, the stitching seems correct. And these are the kind of things you gotta look for. So the material and the stitching. One thing about the Germans was that everything they did was very well done. Until the end of the war, it started getting a little lackadaisical. But I don't know how many flags they're making at the end of the war. They're making a lot of guns and things like that. But to be honest with you, this is one of those items that could be worth thousand, five thousand dollars. Just don't know. It has this patch on it. That patch is probably going to be the big, big important part about it. And also has all this frill on there. And this was a ornamental flag, probably maybe inside a building, maybe like a German nazi party headquarters or something like that so we'll have to find out what that means in german well it, it looks like it says like beckhofen b-e-c-h-h-o-f-e-n yeah. that could just be the city i'm not sure that is a crazy find what else are you going to find in here <laughs> how do you follow that oh my gosh is that clark gable yeah so with a picture of Clark Gable, man, it looks like it's actually hand drawn. It does look like it. And it looks like it's signed down here. But whoever did it was a a good artist. Maybe the person that painted those other paintings. I don't know. We got old pictures. I'm just thinking this guy might have been in World War II. 
I'm hoping we can find some information. I mean, his father or somebody. Because maybe there's something about that flag that we can put two and two together. And if we can prove that he captured it. There's just all these photo albums in here. There's military pictures. There it is. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. That's probably why the flag's in there. So this is going to probably tie two together. Because I'm assuming the guy wasn't a Nazi. I'm assuming the guy was in military World War II. Most of the people would bring back souvenirs, momentums, mementos. And this is things. probably his parents or grandparents. Yes. Look at this. Billiard parlor. That's pretty cool. Old golf station there. So, the photos themselves are definitely going to be worth money. And the flag is worth money. What else is going to be in there? There's another box down here. Definitely more pictures and albums. Photo albums. This guy likes clocks. It's unfortunate this is broken. I have a similar one like this, but it's in a, a blue. Mine has a little crack, but nothing like this. Unfortunately, this is about unsavable. What you can do is take this part out. If the clock still runs, you could replace it with the one that doesn't. And that would be the only value in it. But this doesn't have value because it has the bubble glass. So don't just say, oh, it's broke. I'm going to throw it in the garbage, Jeff. <clears throat> Very detailed here. You're getting really professional. Am I? Yeah. I'm sorry. Don't mean to. Drop something on your head. That's what I need. So look at all this. Vintage birthday cards. I should send somebody one of these. <laughs> May your birthday be in every way an extra happy and wonderful day. Well wishes. So I'm assuming somebody out there would like vintage birthday cards. What the heck is this? Look at this. These are Advent speakers. Indoor, outdoor. Oh boy. So these are probably about $50 speakers. Let me go those two. Nice. There's a pair of them. This guy definitely likes speakers, audio stuff, or maybe his grandparents or whoever. But it looks like maybe multiple generations. They put stuff in here. Got some old plates. Little trivets. A whole mixture of plates down here. What do you value that box at, Jeff? Zero. <laughs> Not a lot, unfortunately, because it's a mismatch. Oh, man. Look at this. I didn't even notice this. What are you old man about we now? we got a pressure washer right here. Oh, there's milk jugs. Back and then there. a milk jug. Man. And man and space. Remember the Muppets? We really need to find a toy. Look at this. See this old fan right here? I do. Now this has that look that people like. And I will explain one thing to you, ladies and gentlemen. These old fans, a lot of people say, oh, the old fans, da, da, da. the metal blade, it pushes air way better than a plastic fan. If you don't believe me, get a metal blade fan. You'll find out. Don't put your finger in there. You did see this earlier, a track fan. Got some one speaker in there. Shredder, sewing stuff, but a shredder that shreds paper. More so. Buttons. We did find the button collection last I love time. buttons. I don't love them. I like them. You like buttons? I do. Encyclopedia still sealed. We got number 12 and 16. Oh, look at that. Some more cameras? That's oh, just one camera. Hanamix Compact? Giant serving platter. Oh my gosh. Cool. Uh, cabbage Patch Kids. What do we got here? Magazines. How to fix anything. Not too much. I could have wrote that. I could have wrote that book. That's true. Cabbage Patch. There's only three things you need in life. Duct tape, Velcro, and propane. That's not true. We'll talk about it later. Ice cream. Is this an easy bake oven? That's what 
that is. So this is stuff he must have put in here later on. What a remote control helicopter. Right, we got this cool Empire mold. That's the company, one of the best companies out there. It is a bunny mold. If it was Santa Claus, something would be worth more money, but blow molds, probably at least 25, 30 bucks. Santa Claus, 50 to 100. You say this is all tools, Jeff? I would think the bunny would be rare. It's rare, but not a lot of people do. Two inch trailer ball hitch. I need a two and a three quarter or something like that. Yeah, a drill. All kind of tools and stuff. Here. Plumbing kit. New screws. So, worth a few bucks. And more of these. This guy had so many snow sleds. We got some retro table, some fold out table. Oh, oh, it's a poker table. There you go. I'll bet you something. I'll bet you something. Tools and then this pressure washer. I don't see anything with it though. My, my guess is it's in here. Sounds like it's got compression. We thought it was a pressure washer? It's I actually did. a little generator. So that makes it worth more money. I would say at least a hundred dollar bill. Easy. More tools. Stanley electric stapler. Another black and decker drill. Oh, look at this. Dremel pack, new. Here's a little driller, weller. One soldering gun. So this little unit keeps adding up. Got some cash here, cash there. And some surprises everywhere. I wouldn't call this a little unit. Oh yeah. Well, it's only a five <laughs> by, I mean a 10 by 15, but it's packed to the ceiling, so. It's gonna be 10 feet tall. Oh. oh, rusted. Not too bad. It's got character. Jeff would buy it. It's got character. Yeah, a little metal cabinet down here, file cabinet. We're going up. <laughs> Look how, look how tall it is. Look right here. Uh oh. We found the Dreamcast earlier. Yeah. That's a remote control for it. Maybe this has more. Oh, yeah. The Sega cord. Here's some of the cords we need for our electronics. That box goes with the other one. Well, that's a good, good find right there. And we got a Roto Zip. The fourth edition. First aid book. I wish it was the first, it'd be worth one. Dr. Seuss. Dr. What's Seuss. it? The foot book? Yeah. I don't know that I've ever read that one. I don't know how I did that either. These are the golden books. The first editions can be worth some money. And an angel. I always think those are neat. How do they make those? I don't know. That's a good question. Something I don't know, Jeff. I think you do, you just don't want to tell me. What's in here? That's a big shell. Uh huh. Uh huh. All right. Sorry, that was Aquaman. <laughs> what? That's <laughs> funny. <laughs> All right, we got more cool stuff here. <laughs> Aquaman. Oh, what is this? And he moves on. Oh. It just looks old. It definitely looks old. Like a little dust or uh, little dresser box. What's that material called? Eh, it might be lucite. It's not bakelite, I don't think. Either way is nice, right? Yeah, it is nice. Bakelite would be worth more. Had a great chicken barbecue and then went to watch the Browns beat Houston. Come on, move on. We know that's not true. This is 1995. Oh, yeah, Browns were good in 95. Got wedding photos in here. We got more old photos. Salt and pepper gavels. State of America. This guy was definitely, or somebody, was a president of North Ohio Municipal Court Clerks Association. So he worked for the court system. Maybe that's why they got all these gavels. What's this thing, Jeff? I think that went on the end of something and you just beat people with it or something? It looks a little scary. Oh, you hit that. It looks a little scary. So I, you got to you got to come up with something with the gavel. Well, you know auctioneers. Oh, these, these, I demand more pepper. Well, you know auctioneers have gavels. Right. The hammer price. Right. 
So that's what the whole hammer pray about. Hey, what do you want? 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 15, 
What the heck? It's a broken Pegasus. I think it's a unicorn Pegasus. That's the rarest kind. Old tapes. What kind of tapes are we gonna have, Jeff? Cassettes. See? Oh, nice. Rolling Stone. Grateful Dead. So, Eric Clapton. So, the regular tapes do have money. People are listening to tapes again, I heard. So, that's kind of strange, but things always come around. Just a couple of years ago, they were out. Look at this. We got the Muppet Babies and the Bear Stain <coughs> Bears. Oh, Miss Piggy! I know you like Miss Piggy. You had a crush on her, didn't you, Jeff? She was okay. I liked oh, her. Oh, I liked box. her spunk. It's old. What the? Photos. Shades. Yeah, that cloth, that handkerchief threw me off. Yeah, it threw me off too. What the? Oh my gosh. Task of binoculars, it's missing the rubber pieces. Oh yeah, they still work though. Hello? Hello? Oh, they can't see me. So, old binoculars. I mean, this, again, yeah, there's just no rhyme, no reason. Okay. What is it? The power hand piece should not. Is that a toothbrush? I think it might be a, what's it called? Uh, it could be an electric toothbrush, yeah. An old school. That's yeah. There's another dial down here. Oh, what's this? There we go. Wow. That's an oldie. And then there's a lens down here too. Sometimes the lenses are more valuable than anything. They definitely don't go together. Mm -mm. But that's a cool looking camera. Like I said, being different, I've seen a lot of cameras, but these are the other camera we found in the last episode. This one, definitely different types of cameras. And we even got, hello, Mickey Mouse. Hello. Do you like my Mickey Mouse impression? Man? I wish people could see me shaking my head. <laughs> you didn't like it? 99th Infantry Division? Huh. Interesting. That might have been the division in his military thing we found that flag from. We'll have to do some research. We got this metal cabinet out. Let's see what's in here. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's cool. Hold on a second. It's broken. Uh, Look at that. Two old clocks. This guy definitely has some old clocks. Big crock pile. There's more clocks in here. It's part of a clock. Clocks are money. And I got a bunch of clocks in this auction. And then crock pot. Ooh, here's some new shades for you. I'm Flip good. The future's so bright, you gotta wear shades. A bag. A wreath. So we're just slowly peeling back the layers of this onion. It's a big, big onion. We got some household stuff here. More plates. But a lot of them it's like a hodgepodge. It's not like a whole set of one. And some plates can be worth some money. These are definitely older ones, but a lot of them have chips, cracks, takes away from the value. Oh, another clock? Craftsman? I didn't know Craftsman Sears made a razor. That's a nice mm -hmm. razor there. You know, you don't use that, Jeff. I need a trim. I'll show you trim you up right now. Baby pictures, more pictures. Battle Babies, 99th Division. So these are the things we got to look for because we found that flag. There's a good chance he could have been in one of these military divisions. Okay. 
Oh, wow. That's three razors we found so far. Let's make it four. Celebrating life's most cherished moments with an apple peeler. It's a brand new apple peeler in the box. And then guess what? There's another apple core peeler in the box. I had one one time go for like over five hundred dollars. Must have been a rare one. Yeah, the guy said there's only a few of them made. And how would you ever know that? You wouldn't. I would. Did you have it in an auction? Yep. That's why we put things in auction, ladies and gentlemen, because that's how you're going to get two, the hot At least two people knew it was worth something. And that's all that matters. Photographs. Man for man, the Indians of today look as good as 1920 edition. More military photos. Oh, there's the Mona Lisa. Do you see that? Uh -uh. There's the Mona Lisa. All kind of different. So, old pictures, photos. This looks like it has a bunch of old photos going down here. It's getting old. Ooh. <coughs> I like this. That is old. It's probably like the old, uh, hit someone with that. It's for a horse. No, it's not. That's for self defense? Yeah, that's self defense. For offensive offense? Yeah, that's why it has this like weighted end on it, and you hold it like this with the leather around it. Like that, you hit someone, break a bone, knock you out. It won't feel well. Who would use those? Self protection. Like what year, what time period? Uh, probably 50s, 60s. 50s? Coca Cola wall hook? Like inner city or ships, or where would you use that? Anywhere, Jeff, that you would need protection. Where there's some ruffians, you know what I'm saying? Well, I'm glad I grew up where I didn't have to have those. You probably were the ruffian, that's probably why. Well, I had some issues. <laughs> so it looks like a bunch of old photos. Weird stuff though, mixed in with the photos. Got some books. Got all these. These look like yard long photos. Ninety ninth Infantry Division Battle Baby, seventeenth Annual Reunion, New York City, July nineteen sixty six. So I'm pretty sure he's a ninety ninth Infantry Division, the Battle Babies, and he captured a German flag. So would it be possible that this thing was to get stuff out of Germans? Yeah. Really? Could been. That's, it could have been. That's scary. It is scary. Oh, man. Look at all this, Jeff. I know. What'd you get me into? <laughs> Just think, you didn't get the other 10 by 15. The guy had two of these. That would have been crazy. So, here's some, some old model. Candle holder. It's a little bent. That's old school candle holder. It is old school. It's worth a few bucks for sure. Hey, I think this is, what is table hey do you think the carpet will clean up? Yeah, probably. Okay. Like pin something table, something like tables. I forgot these metal pieces. They, they call them a certain thing. There's a name? Yeah, there's a name for those type of lights. We got this box and, man, look at that bike. Look at this vintage Schwinn right here. Usually when the shifters are down here, it makes it, it's a more valuable bike. A bright racing bike. Sonoma, this is made in Japan. These Soma and the Schwinn, we gotta look them up. These could be $100, $200 bikes, maybe even more. What's in wasn't, the there, box? wasn't there a seat down there somewhere yeah, on the floor? Seat, yeah. Ugh. Ugh. We don't want to see if it's bad. It just looks like a juicer. It's all like dirty, oh. dusty. This grind. The good thing is Jeff can clean up anything. Oh, yeah. What well, do you say, Jeff? Elbow grease, right? Yep. A little spit polish. A little spit polish. Stuff on the ground here. Never know about old clothes. Alcoa. So that's an aluminum manufacturer, right? Yeah, it's big metal steel, right? Yeah. I think they need aluminum. Aluminum. Oh, that's cool. Hard Rock Cafe. Live fast, rock hard. 
On the back is the hard rock and the guitars. It says New York. That's cool. Oh yeah. Memories. What's it gentlemen. say? Steve's Hot Dogs. Steve's Hot Dog Lunch. This is located across the street from our building. Was. Caught on fire. We used to go all the time and I loved going there because I could get breakfast and I love breakfast, my favorite meal. I get that for lunch. They had good hot dogs too. And they were open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. So they're open 24 hours. So you can imagine two, three in the morning after the bars would close. It was a popular hangout spot. What year did they catch on fire? Whew. Roughly. Probably five years ago. Five years ago? Pre-pandemic, that's for sure. Huh. Man, there's a giant stainless steel bowl. Metal bowl. Another one of those crazy fans. The rocks. It says Cleveland, Ohio. <clears throat> I believe it was built in Cleveland. I tell you what, you want me to tell you a little story? I'm going to tell you a little story. All right. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, a metal fan's better than a plastic fan. Why? I don't know. Did you say why? <laughs> metal you blades didn't? don't bend, that's why. Oh, uh, yeah. Metal blades don't bend. Touch. Made in the USA. Genuine leather. A lot of people would discount this, but this is something. I mean, that's old. Look at how it's tied. This is probably 1950s, 60s, maybe even 40s. And so, leather, people like to hang that up if you're into boxing. Some people like the old. Here you hold it and I'll hit it. Stuff in here. One fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish, that's your favorite. Oh yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. You, know, you can never make it to them. Portable tape cassette player. In the original box. Priceless, Jeff. Priceless. I'd say not more than 20. 15. Ooh, look down there. This is some crazy stuff in here. I like wood decorations. I got this beaded purse. Get that out of the way. We like the hand carved stuff. We got this hand carved wall hanger. German sunflower, I guess. Oh, all those go to it? All these. Oh, uh, you have to figure out exactly. I'm not exactly sure. I think I'm, it looks like about um, that thing's gonna look awesome. It up. is, that is gonna be neat. That is an unbelievable. I mean, that's so he probably was stationed in Germany. Probably why he got some of this stuff here. How do you know it's German? Does it say German? I, it's, I could tell you. This is German. Oh, you, this just, is, you just know. Yeah, this is German. Um, what is that called? Black walnut or whatever. Uh, Black the, Forest. Yeah, from the Black Forest, German. Yeah. It's like where they make the cuckoo clocks out of. Same wood. I'll okay, I'll there. give Ooh. you that. That makes sense. That makes total sense. If it doesn't make sense, then it doesn't make dollars. <laughs> Alright, come that, on. That didn't make sense. Uh, uh, oh, hoo -hoo. No way. Yes, way. It just look, got to look of gold, doesn't it? Oh, man. Are you thinking gold? Are you calling gold or not? Costume I see, I see, or gold? I see it. Well, there's gold. I'm just calling gold. I see a couple pieces of gold. Do you? I think. I see gold. So, I can tell you, some pieces aren't gold. Like, this is stuff that looks like gold. It looks like gold to me. But it's not gold. It's not gold. I don't think so. To me, it's too shiny. Oh, what's it say there? I'm right. I'm hoping it's gold. It says Korea. Yeah, Korean gold. So, definitely jewelry. This piece here, this looks like it could be gold. No, it's not gold. It's probably not. You're just yanking our chain. It's possible. Yeah, I don't think it's gold. It's got the hippie sign on it. That's pretty neat. I think it's just an earring attached to it. Oh, that was a hippie earring, or yep. peace sign earring? Yeah, there's all kinds of little pendants in here. There's a little clock pendant. Money. Sometimes these Italian horns, those are worth money. I mean, they're, I mean, they're gold. So we'll have to look at that. Woohoo! That could be gold. Get out. Nope. But a lot of times, that herringbone like that will be gold. So, definitely got jewelry. I don't know how much gold, but some costume for sure. And, uh, 
cool, cool piece of wood here. The machine just keeps surprising, surprising, surprising. It's like, surprise, 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 like Gomer Pyle. Old tapestry. And there's just so much old stuff in here. You, stuff you just can't, I mean, sometimes a, a piece like that could go for two, three hundred dollars. Oh! So this looks like the stuff, it looks like he was in the court. Clerk of court. So here's his court stuff in here. Here's a folded military flag. So that's the family member that was in, in the war, I think. Probably, could have been a family member in the war for sure. Knights of Columbus, Ohio Association Court. So, some pictures. Fake paintings. These are kind of cool. Yeah, it's got a look. The Mexican. Look at this. Money, money, money. Oh, yeah. Here. Can I take those in that's, case? In that's money for you today. In case the checks don't work. The checks bounce? Hey. What is this? Should I, should I make a memo that, uh, how much you gave me? Yeah. Let's <laughs> write it down. Channel that's, that's magnet? Genius. Magic? Ooh. No clue. Try the power magic, your channel magic. Costs a little, and you want you want it for each TV set as gifts. TV armchair ease and control. Turn TV on and off without getting up. Fifteen foot cord allows TV control almost anywhere in the room. Fifteen foot cord, really? Oh my goodness. Dude. You could almost go in the kitchen with that. If you, you don't even need batteries or remote anymore. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is getting interesting. That's kind of funny. That's getting interesting. Look oh, horn. horn. Could be authentic. Looks authentic. Yeah, it looks like a powder horn almost. Would they be... I don't know. A lot of times they'd use that for a powder yep. horn, for a gun. <clears throat> this is what making the box so heavy, this guy. He looks like he was part of a lamp. Maybe he's broke though, unfortunately. Oh, that's good. Where's the toy at? Those are ladders for a cast iron toy. For a fire truck? You know it. Got some old buttons down here. Maybe photo buttons. America. United to fight for jobs. Cleveland Council of Unemployed Workers. Huh. You're probably not going to believe this, but I myself like humorous buttons. Oh, you do? Yeah. I got a lot of them for you. I have a few. Oh. Keychain. Older. Brand new. Need a leather keychain? Yeah. I got one for you, pal. I'm here for you, Jeff. Oh, there's more of them. I'm going to set up some new business. Oh, look at that. Home and auto. Remove trunk and home keys when parking. Smart idea. Yeah. Oh, what is this? Model railroader. If you find if you find railroad stuff in here, or we might. Some place. There's more of these. Another bag full of those. What if you find trains? You haven't find found what? trains in a while. I know, I used to find trains all the time. People said every unit I find trains in, and I haven't, I haven't found trains for a while. Yeah, now you're just getting dirty old jewelry. Yeah, a lot of jewelry lately. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Is that one of those spinner things? Oh, those things are neat. Man, can we play with that later? It's brand new, sorry. So what? We can't open it's got, it. Yeah, you can. That Dude, needs brand to be, new old that stuff. Doesn't, but that's meant to be played with. Let's not put on a shelf and look at it. No, that toy rock. It hasn't even been punched right there. Oh, that's no. We're gonna have to get this graded, Jeff. Yeah, we'll see. I'll have to get that graded. Yeah, after I play with it. I'm like, what happened? Some kind of little old set. A stocking set for Christmas. Yeah. Some old stuff coming out of this unit for sure. <laughs> I like that. Liberty Bell buckle. Blackhead. Oh.
I can't get a good glow on the on the diamond. I don't know if it's a real diamond. It's, real it's presented diamond. nice though. It says the Vanderbilt Jewel. It is presented nice. Unbelievable. We'll have to get our loop out for that one. And that's the thing, these boxes, you're just about to give up on them and the next thing you know. The box is falling apart. Yeah, it is falling apart. Invitations. 1977. Oh man, I never should should I send it back in so, the mail? Would that be hilarious? <laughs> Look at it's already stamped. It won't make it. That's not funny. <laughs> it's funny. Could you imagine they were like, uh Speaking of invitations, do you uh have you been to any like high school graduation parties lately? Yeah, it's not like that. No. I'm not allowed back in my high school. Any of my high school. No, I mean like like friends or family that have not graduation. No, Just so I know what it costs. Oh, it's how like, much money? How much are you supposed to give? In the comments, let us know how much money you're supposed to give for a graduation party. If they're close well, to you, I say 100, not close 50. 100 or 50? That's my, that's my saying. That's a lot of money. Woohoo! Couldn't I give them an old fan or something? Have another cuckoo clock. Wow. That's four, right? Probably four. I don't know. You're keeping track better than me, then. Look at this. That's a light-up Madonna and baby Jesus. That's vintage goodness if I've ever seen Why do you Jesus. say Madonna? Oh, they call her the Madonna. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, that's Mary and Jesus. But yeah, this is like the Madonna right here. Lee Mean Grilling Machine? I thought you meant like Madonna. Brand new. Nice. It just keeps giving and giving, Jeff. Those have been around for a while. A long time. You got books in here. Stick on jewelry. Alice in Wonderland. Jeff's Christmas stock. Oh, it's a hat. I thought it was your stocking. Here we go. You say your stocking something. You're gonna read us a story? I was going to. Please don't. Didn't you tell me like one time you wanted me to joke around a little less and we need to be more serious. You like to come across as serious? I always come across as serious. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I mean, I'm the most serious person you know. <laughs> I was gonna say, that doesn't help. What? You being you. So you're saying you don't take Santa Claus seriously? Is that what you're trying to tell me? I believe. We got something on our blanket, Jeff. What I know. That? I've been looking at that. What the? It's wicker and round. Is that a table? Coffee table on its side. Table. What kind of top goes with it? Old white. These are dangerous lights, though, because if you put too much, the wrong bulb in there, it melts it out. Been there, done that. Old radio record player in here. It's definitely a vintage. Piece. And it is the Trimatic. Trimatic or something. More photo albums. It actually looks like it'd clean up pretty nice. Wagner Party Center, 1983. More pictures. Oh my gosh, look at this. Oh, unabridged. Second edition, Webster Dictionary. You know what this is for? No. You know when they say they're going to throw the book at you? <laughs> you know, you know that I think it's funny. The only dictionary I need is about a quarter of that thickness. I would say less than that. Anyways, <laughs> moving on. <laughs> Look at that. Mid-century modern goodness. It's a pretty cool table, huh? I like it. I like it. We got all kinds of stuff back here. What is this thing, Jeff? I don't know. For a cat. All oh, resilient. I don't think it's for a cat. I think it's like for. You're supposed to sit on it somehow. Oh, you, you don't need to try it. You really, you really need to try it. It's a little dirty. I'll keep you in, Jeff. Thanks for ruining my good time. Thank you. Old rug. You sold some rugs for two, three hundred dollars. A rail systems, LeBra. Is that a tonneau cover? It's 
see the back wall? Good. That's a good sign or a bad sign? Let's say that's good. Belt sander? That's good. Gosh, it's so much stuff up here. I'm scared to grab something. Don't, oh! Don't be scared. Oh, yeah. I just see something up there. Did we wear some more? Percolator. I mean, you had a percolator, Jeff. Quite often, actually. We On vacation, my wife got me turned on to percolators. I have my own little percolator. Not a French press? No, no, just a percolator. You ever have French press coffee? No. Oh. I just like black coffee. All right, what we got in here? A tin, and a tin, and a tin, and a tin. Empty. You know, you know what five tins make? What? A 50. Oh man, oh look at that! The circus train. I had this when I was a kid. And oh look at the elephants. Oh, these are worth a few bucks. And they still got the tail and ears. These always got pulled off by the kids. Oh, we got the lion down here. Now we're getting the circus. Where's the rest of the circus trains? The animals are worth money though. What is that? Here we go. We're seeing a dragon on an orange mountain. Pretty impressive. Dragon flight. Oh, that's no, no that's uh, one of them knights in armor. Oh boy! Hey, 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 hey! I'm talking to you. Do you wanna do you wanna duel me? You wanna mess with me? Do you wanna duel me? Let me tie up my armor. Let's see. Oh, oh! Does it work, Willie McGee? Did it work? Yeah, it worked. You didn't feel we that? We two lions and two elephants for the train. Oh, some more old photos. Old, old, old. I don't know what they are. I bet you those pictures were taken with that camera. That's yeah, true. Probably one of the cameras. That old one. 99th Infantry Division. 1978 Cincinnati. So we definitely know he was in the infantry division, 99th Infantry. We got more books in here. Oh, here we go. Testing, testing. Jeff, Jeff, do you hear me, Jeff? What? Can you hear me, Jeff? Yes, it works. We got some books, ashtrays. Downtown Las Vegas, Holiday International Casino. That's not long around anymore. So sometimes these old ashtrays like that from casinos that don't exist can't be worth a few bucks. I'm not sure if the unit had a leak or what. I see this old box that's water damaged. Nasty. Nasty. Some games and stuff. Kodak Insta camera. Here's up. Special troops. Infantry division. History of it. Activated in November 16, 1942 at Camp Van Dorn in Mississippi. Talks about attacks and things they did, so have to keep that one on the other stuff on we got. Your favorite uncle. Only when he hands you some money right. instead of taking it. Yeah, that don't happen. That don't happen much, does it, Jeff? Not to me. <laughs> I'm not sure what we got here. Oh, wow. Some old hats. That's like turn of the center, or like a roaring yeah, 20s. I, right I, there. Missed, I missed you wearing that one. I was really kick quicker. I don't think so. Oh, it's alright, too late. 
off. We got some old hats. People always like, Rob, I can't believe you put that on your head. Trust me, that's the most dangerous thing I've done in my life. I'm sure there's nothing could come off of it. Been in here how long? Everything should be dead. Or maybe still alive. Christmas bulbs. Doesn't look like they're crawling. I don't feel like they're crawling. They're more glass. Here. What the heck? More dolls. So we got a Halloween ghost in there. Thai beanie babies. Halloween witch. So, just wasn't expecting to find that. Oh my gosh. Oh. Royale typewriter. Ooh, mint green. Might be worth a few bucks. You have to look it up. A saber. Believe it or not, sometimes I sold typewriters for 50 to 100 bucks. The most ever, 350. Every time I go in here, I just don't know what I'm going to find. I see something like Coca Cola down there. Fountain bottles. That's a thick crystal vase. You always want to see if it's marked on the bottom. I don't see anything, Jeff. Sounded like it, though. It sounds good. What the heck? Our wedding day. Hmm. Wedding pictures. And then all these boxes down here. I'm not sure what these are. Christmas bulbs. Or ornaments. So, hmm. No rhyme. No reason. Swiss Family Robinson. Condition's not great, but definitely an old book. 1916. Oh, this is the 1938 edition. Still 1938. Seeds. Ceramic house. Looks like one of my phones. <laughs> Dell computer. Another computer. Oh my gosh. Wow. <laughs> that might be one of the first ones ever. Yeah. Look how thick that is. And sometimes old electronics have been actually increasing in value. Old computers and stuff. So if that's one, one of the first laptops ever, it could be worth some good money. CDs. Hatchet head. Seen better days. Watch. That sounds like a song. <laughs> Old hatchet heads seen better days. And a made in Italy rosary. Woodstock. Oh no. Oh, yes. <sighs> what is that? It is a wind up toy made in Japan. Here it is. Super snow boat. So this is the. It looks like it was probably new. Seeing how it would fit in there. <laughs> how does that oh, I see. This had to go somewhere. Hmm. I don't know, Jeff. We'll have to figure it out. But man, that's a cool little vintage toy. Jeff knows I like my old toy. Oh, it sparks in the back, too. You are not part of the solution. You're a part of the problem, Jeff. Yeah. Oh, there's the top. I have a quarter for every time I heard that. Oh, neat. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now, now we're cooking with mustard. Never seen that one before. Me neither. Friends in high places. And then Great we got the song. Woodstock three disc album set. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, sparks fly out. I hope it don't catch a box on for you. Ain't gonna get away. So we got the three vinyl set. Unfortunately, these records. A little you know, corped. A little bent. Nothing a little oven action can't fix, Jeff. <laughs> Look at this. Broken bust. I think it's Julius Caesar. 
What do you think? Yep. I'm gonna have to agree with you on that one. Yeah, I can argue that one. Well, who's this guy? Santa Claus is coming to town. It's Nick. 1973. Ceramic Santa. Oh my gosh. Another old clock. That's a big Ben. Not great condition. This unit. This makes no sense, Jeff. Now the question, what's in here? Oh. Sleepy Sam. It has so much stuff in it. We're definitely gonna have to make another episode. But I want to get to that one box I saw up there, but we have to move a few things first. Real the real. This is old film and believe it or not I've done well with old film like that so something I never pitch another old clock I got this clock too mine's not that color mine's blue oh my gosh so this person was definitely into watches and clocks or their grandfather or somebody I like that one. That is nice. I just wish all these are mint condition, but that one's not too bad a shape. I like that one. Eagle. So there's a piece of the parts down here, clocks. It definitely has some value. A grinding wheel. What are you trying to get up to? The one that says with the cars? Yeah. Little backpack up here. Oh. That one got you oh, right in the chest. Oh, yes. What do you owe yes in? Oh, you'll see. I think there's not one. I think there's two. Really tough to get out. What's on top of it? Some kind of wood. These down first. That'd help you, but I'm filming. That's a good idea. Try not to get your arms in the way. Oh, look at this. Zeus? Looks like Zeus, maybe. It's pretty cool. That was like an old, that's like I think in Athens or Greece or something, and that, like one of the first white towers. It would have a big torch in it for ships could see at nighttime. Madonna. So definitely. Some cool pictures. It says from F. Josh Lamb Company Collection. This is the Hanging Gardens of Babylon. That's the Tower of Babel. Do you know anything about Tower of Babel, Jeff? I do not. I can't believe how much I don't know. Well, the Tower of Babel was built by the Babylonians to reach God. So they built this tower and kept building higher and higher. And then it got destroyed by God. Supposedly. Oh, I'm getting excited. Alright. I love old toys. Motor Riffic Wildcat Racer. Now the cars are in there, it's gonna be the money. cars so unfortunately it's going to affect the value a lot but you got another one up here Jim don't try this at home he's going up I'm a trained professional only on Wednesdays Woo -hoo, come on. it's not what I oh. thought it was but it's 1937 Corolla model that looks all there that's probably a few bucks itself Wow, wow, wow. We're going to definitely have to see. We got, looks like LPs back here. Who knows what other vintage goodness. Packed to the stack, to the ceiling. There's a bunch of trunks over here. Appreciate you guys all watching. Don't forget, subscribe, like, hit the bell. We're going to have to make another video for this unit. It's been unbelievable. Found a little bit of everything. One item could be worth, who knows, five, ten thousand dollars $10,000. Great historical significance. Wow, wow, wow. Have a wonderful day.